Okay, what if I told you that you can get a free halation effect in DaVinci Resolve without having to buy the studio version? Halation is like an orange-red halo around highlights and it is one of the characteristics of traditional film cameras, which nowadays we often feel as cinematic. I use it in almost every of my films. But I'm not gonna talk too much, this is gonna be a straight to the point tutorial, so here is the sauce. Okay, these are the two clips that we're gonna apply the halation effect on. And quick shout out to George the Colorist. I have watched his video a few years ago where he explained this exact method that I'm gonna show you today, but in a much more detailed way because his knowledge is so insane. I have learned so much from his videos, so go check out his channel, I'm gonna link it down below. Okay, first things first, go to the halation node itself, right click on it, go to composite mode and on screen. And now don't worry if it's blown out, we're gonna fix that. Go to the blur and sharpen tool here and the radius, pull it all the way up. Let's say 1.19. And now on the gain wheel here in the primaries, I'm not in a log wheel, I'm in the primaries. On the gain wheel, push it towards a yellow orange, let's say here. And now go to the curves here and I'm gonna make sure editable splines is off. Create a point with left mouse click and just hold it and drag it all the way down. And wait if I'm zooming in on the eye here. I'm gonna pull this point here all the way to the right on the highlights and now you are gonna create a halo because this is the brightest part here on the image and with the blur tool here we can refine it now i'm just gonna play with these parameters with the radius tool with the tone curve and with the gain wheel here and i'm gonna control f for full screen and control d to disable the node and enable it now let's move on to our next image here. On the halation tab, as I said, right click, composite mode, screen, go to the blur tab here, blur it out. On the primary wheel, push it towards a yellow orange. And now go to the tone curve and create a point here, drag it all the way down and all the way to the right. And now I'm just gonna play with the gain, with the tone curve here and the radius here. Watch out for next week's color grading tutorial where I'm gonna show you how to get a film look with the free version in DaVinci Resolve. Subscribe, leave a like and as always, take care of yourself.